all right ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the channel guys today we have some very good news good rumors or good i shouldn't even say rumors good report coming out of evan massey today if you are a los angeles laker fan but before we get into it guys if you enjoy this video if you wouldn't mind hitting the like button hitting that sub button i would love if this video could get to 100 likes but most importantly i am about 70 subscribers away from 3,000 or <laughs> 3,000 subscribers i'm about 70 subscribers away from 5,000 subscribers so any support is greatly appreciated but a tweet came out from Evan Massey not too long ago and he said that he's heard from multiple sources that the Lakers and Carmelo Anthony are very interested in joining forces this offseason if you're a Laker fan this is just this is music to your ears man this is music to your ears what I think that the Lakers need to do is they need to get a couple of more just proven players. They don't necessarily need to be veterans. You know, they don't need to be 36 year old, you know, every time Carmel, you know, you don't have to be going after 36 year old Chris Paul, 36 year old Carmelo Anthony. You don't have to keep it that old. However, the addition of Chris Paul, the addition of Carmelo Anthony would be so beneficial to this team. But I think for the Lakers, they, they've got the size maybe add one more big man like guy like Dwight Howard would be Dwight Howard would honestly be perfect but the bench needed work the starting lineup needed work last season and it was evident in the playoffs when LeBron and AD just weren't or AD especially missed out and neither of them really seemed to be 100% for majority of the season so I think they just need to get more depth and you get a guy like Carmelo Anthony he's coming off a solid year played in 69 games still put up 13 and a half points per game three and a half rebounds still shot the ball from deep at a high level 41 percent from three-point range last year shot five threes a game the year before that 39 percent he is a career 35 percent three-point shooter and that's exactly what you're looking for if you're the if you're the lakers he also is a good free throw shooter shot 89 percent from the free throw line this past season that's exactly what the los angeles lakers could use as well so you go out you get more pieces you Carmelo Anthony wouldn't be enough to take this Lakers team to like that next level. However, the signing of Carmelo Anthony could, it's going to add more depth to them, but it also could help influence other free agents to come and sign with LA. It could be like, all right, hmm, Carmelo Anthony's 36 years old. He is definitely trying to get a ring and he believes LA is the best opportunity for him to get that so you know let's I'm gonna go join LeBron I'm gonna go join Melo and I could definitely see if Carmelo Anthony signs with the Lakers I could definitely see Chris Paul ending up signing with the Lakers as well so this is gonna be a busy offseason for every team in the NBA obviously but it's gonna be a very busy offseason for the Los Angeles Lakers you've got the NBA draft here in just a couple of days so i wouldn't be surprised if they actually ended up moving that but i i wouldn't be surprised if they also used it moved it maybe later or if they just kind of got a guy for their future however you've got lebron you've got ad in this window right now i wouldn't be surprised if they figured out a way to to bait that trade put or bait that pick into a trade Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for today. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button, hit that sub button. Like I said, I'm about 70 subscribers away. 72, I want to say, from 5,000. All the support means so much to me. But most importantly, guys, I want you to go ahead and comment down below if Carmelo Anthony will be a good fit for the Los Angeles Lakers or if not. That is all. Peace.